All right, guys, Georgia boy here. Got a little unboxing this morning. Nothing, nothing too spectacular, but some folks like to to see unboxings. I had an old uh, gun kicking around back there in the closet for a while now, and it was just wasn't something I was interested in. The boys wasn't interested in, so I sold it and decided I'd just reinvest the money into supplies. And so I got these here a little while back, uh, the CB113812 wad. They work in these Remington game holes, tapered holes. That's what I use for my double lock buck load. And I've got cases of that stuff. So got plenty of double lock buck to load up there now. Then this package has come from Midway and it's been iced in out there in Missouri for the last week or so. But it finally came today, and a couple more boxes of the Hornady 160 FTX. That's got us in good shape there for the 3030. And then these are Spear Boat Tail 145 grains for the 708. And then I'll probably have to cut these open here. I'll take a look at those. All right. So these are some of uh, the Midway Factory Second bullets. These are 223. And these are Sierra Game Kings. It's a little 55 grain boat tail hollow point Sierra Game King. And they look perfect to me. And so we'll be loading up some of those for the AR. Got a good deal on those. No issue there. And this one I was really after. A new, lo uh, a new mold from Lee. And this mold has been out less than a year uh, but I, you know, I, I didn't know about it till just here recently. And it is a Lee number one buck. Lee had uh, several of the others, but they didn't have a number one buck mold. And then sometime last year, this, this mold came out. And so when I finally knew about it, I wanted to get one. Because number one is probably my favorite uh, buck shots, 30 caliber. 18 pellet, typical Lee mold there. So we'll get that cleaned up, get it ready to, to do some casting. I've got another uh, order from Midway on the way with rifle reloading stuff. And another order coming from Precision, uh, more shotgun stuff for something else. So that kind of tells you what I got planned in the works for this year. And uh, you guys know what what this year is. You, you know what's coming. It's cold now and everybody's held up and uh, trying to stay warm. But warm weather is coming. And when warm weather gets here, hordes of people will leave their keyboards in their basements and hit the streets full of ramen noodles and Cheetos and cheap soda. The Dems down there in the cemetery will start mailing in their ballots. It will clog the nation's shipping and bring it to a halt. So if there's something you need, get your order in now. And don't say Georgia boy didn't warn you. You guys take care.